Hello everyone, welcome back. Thank you for joining me. My name is Canela Sirocco and this is my YouTube channel. So, um, before we get started, I wanted to tell you a few things. Um, and if you just want to get right to the painting, um, feel free to fast forward or use the timestamps in the description below to go right ahead to the painting portion of this video. But I do have some very important things I wanna mention in this little intro. So if you'd like to stick around and hear what they are, don't fast forward. All right, so first things first, um, there's been a lot of stuff going on with me here at the house lately. And I have some news and now it's good news and bad news, stressful news, happy news. I, I'm all in between mixed. Um, so those, for those of you who have been watching me for a really long time, you all know um, we did a massive renovation here on the home last year. Happy, I got the studio I wanted. I'm in my dream studio, got my dream home, my dream kitchen. Everything is great, but we're moving. <laughs> That's right, just as shocked. I know you guys are shocked. I'm pretty shocked too. Um, we are moving. Uh, we listed the house, sold the house um, super duper quick uh, and we are moving and the reasons to it I'm not going to really get into. Um, I will tell you this, we are moving um, to better our future and better our children's future and this is a great move that is happening. Um, it has to do with my husband and his job so we have to move. Um, so I'm, I have mixed emotions about it. I'm super duper sad um, because we've been here 12 years. We built this house, like we built the original house um, and now we built the extension. So, you know, there's a lot in this house that I'm going to miss. And, you know, the kids were born and grew up here, right? So, but you gotta do what you gotta do what's best for your family and for your children and their future. So we are moving and we are moving in the middle of January. So I've got just about two and a bit months to literally declutter this entire house, um, get rid of stuff, purge, pack, and do whatever I can to get ready for this move right after Christmas. Um, now, where am I moving to? For those of you who are in my surrounding area and know the area, I am moving, we are leaving Innisfil, Ontario, and we are moving to London, Ontario. So if you are in and around the London area, please comment below. I would love to know who is from the London area. We are going to be moving to the very far north end of London in the Uplands area. So that is going to be my new home. Uh, we've already purchased a beautiful home um, and I will, once I'm all set up there and all that, I will give you guys a tour and all of that, but that's not happening till January. So that's what's going on. Uh, life is very stressful right now. Um, like it's, it's so crazy right now. It's actually nauseating. <laughs> So um, I am going to do my very best between now and the end of December to stockpile as many videos as I can, um, pre-record videos and have a bunch of them so that while I'm moving and while my whole studio is packed up and by the time I unpack, I have enough videos to still release a video every three days for you guys. So I'm going to stockpile hopefully a bunch of videos and it's going to be a series called All About That Base. So it's basically going to be all videos with each Dutch pour I do. It's going to be a different color base. So I don't know how many videos I'm going to need to do. I'm thinking maybe 15 to 20 videos. So I don't know. I, I haven't really looked that far ahead, but I... I'm going to do all videos, that's the series, and each video is going to have a different colored base. I've already got two started. Um, so my first one that you guys are gonna see is going to be this color as a base. Um, and then my second one is going to be this color as a base. So, and then it'll continue with all kinds of different colors. So if there's a color in particular you guys wanna see as base, let me know because now is the time to tell me 
so that when I'm doing all these videos and stockpiling them, I can take your uh, comments into consideration and do a base. So that is what's happening. Um, I, I don't know what really what else to say other than um, it's going to be a really hard uh, two months for me and my family. And uh, I'm working on all commissions as soon as I can, uh, any commissions that are current. Uh, tonight's video is going to be a commissioned piece as well because um, I got to get those done. They got to dry, they got to get resin, they got to cure, and I got to ship them out before I move. Another thing, um, all current paintings that I have here in the studio that have not sold are going to be put up for sale. And when I mean sale, depending on the piece, it could be something as much as 50% off, uh, 40, 30, it really depends on the piece, but I really need to get rid of everything in this studio um, before I move. So any current pieces that I have, um, I will show you guys, I may do an auction or I just may show them all on the table like I normally do, show you guys what's available and then you guys can email me. I haven't really decided yet what I'm gonna do, but they've gotta go. I, I cannot and I will not pack them up and move them to the new house, they've gotta go. So keep that in mind if you are looking potentially for a Christmas present or wanna give yourself a Christmas present, um, now would be a very good time because I am going to put these all on sale and get rid of them. So um, that's all I can think of right now in terms of my news. I will keep you guys posted as the weeks go by, as I keep posting new videos. Um, but yeah, the other thing I wanted to mention super quick is I am working with Crystal Resin and we are doing a collaboration together and we are getting a kit. So just like I had the Loli Vefi kit with a very good price and all the products, I am now doing one with Crystal Resin. So you can choose between two kits. There is a one liter kit and a one gallon kit and I'll put the pictures of them up here so you guys can see them. And so if you have never used resin before and you've always wanted to try it, now is the time to try it because you can get the one liter kit with glitters and pigments and some silicone molds and then you can test it out and try out resin for the first time. If you've already used resin and you've already used crystal resin, now would be a good time to get a one gallon kit, get all that fun stuff, all those goodies at a very good price. You are saving 25% off, okay? And not only that, shipping to Canada and the US is free. Okay, so not only are you getting 25% off, but you're also saving um, on shipping. So Canada and US shipping for free. Um, I don't think they ship anywhere else outside of Canada and the US. So I apologize for everyone else in Europe and all those places. It's just Canada and the US. And there's only 150 kits per kit. So 150 of the one gallon and 150 kits of the uh, one liter. So if you want this kit, don't delay because you guys also what happened with the Loli Vefi kits. They sold out under 12 hours for the first hundred and then we added another hundred and those sold out under 24 hours. And we just recently added another hundred a couple of days ago. If you're on social media, you would have seen me post that on um, Instagram. There was another hundred kits and those sold out immediately too. So don't delay if you want to try out the resin. So go to the Crystal Resin website. I will put the links in the description below, crystalresin.com, and pick up your kit today. Good time to save. Um, so that is it. I had a few people asking me what happened with my massive 24 by 48 piece that I poured over with the black and did the paint crack and what happened. I told you guys the paint had pooled into the center and stretched out the canvas, but I did want to show you guys what the piece looks like. Um, the paint did not crack at all. Um, it just got distorted. And then you can see, so here's the, I can't even see what I'm doing. So here's the painting. Let me, let me do this so you can see the whole thing. Okay. So there's the painting. Now without knocking anything down, I don't know if you, let me do it this way. I don't know if you can see, but there's like a little ridge. Yeah, you see that? So yeah, there you go. That's what I'm trying to show you guys. That's where the paint had pooled and like started going into the center. So I am not gonna resin it. I I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I'm, 
I was gonna put it in my room, but because we're moving now, I'm not taking it with me. Um, so that being said, if anyone local, okay, because I'm not shipping this anywhere, if you are local or you want to come and pick it up, I will sell this at the most ridiculously cheapest price uh, ever, basically. I, you'll almost be getting it for free, but um, if you are interested in this piece, I just, I can't take it with me. Um, I really have to get rid of a lot of things um, before we move. So if you are interested and you want to drive up to my home in Innisfil um, and purchase this, you can email me at canalasaraco at gmail.com. I will not ship it. So don't ask me to ship it. You got to come and get it. So if anyone is interested and wants to know the price, please email me and I will let you know. So that is it. I know I'm sorry it's like 11 minutes and I'm talking your ear off, but I warned you guys if you didn't want to hear it, fast forward. So that's what's going on. Um, you know, let, I don't want any like negative comments or anything like that. It's It's been hard enough as it is for me. Um, my kids, on the other hand, are ecstatic. They're very, very happy about the move. They do love this house, but there's reasons as to why they're very happy about the move. Reasons I'm not going to get into. Um, but just just so that I'm, you know, it's a great thing. So yes, I'm going to miss this home. Yes, there's a lot of memories here. Yes, I'm very upset about it. But there's some great things to come for my family um, with this change. And that's always what's most important. So that that's it. Um, so I'm going to wrap this up and I'm going to bring you guys down on the canvas and we're going to get started on today's commission piece. Be right back. All right, everybody. So let's get started to today's painting. This is a 15 by 30 inch canvas. And this is, as I mentioned, a commissioned piece for a client. All right. So um, base paint I'm going to be using is Artist Loft Titanium White. Okay. Now this was an empty bottle, so I took advantage and I put my Dutch pour mix in this. So my paint is mixed with Floetrol and water and I put it in this empty bottle and my paints are also mixed with Floetrol and water and they are all mixed the same way. And you can check out video number 63. For those of you who are new watching, you can uh, click on that link up above and you will get a full video tutorial on how I mix my paints. If you are mixing your paints with an um, Australian Floetrol or Ovatrol Floetrol, you can check out video number 345. Okay, um, so yes, that's what I'm using as my base. And I also have it here in this squeeze bottle because I like to use it to do my edges with. And I'm going to tell you the colors now. So I'm going to be using uh, Sky Blue Light by Amsterdam, followed by Pearl Blue by Amsterdam. Then we have 24 Karat Gold by Deco Art. And then I'm going to be using Pearl Pink by Arteza. Then I have Thalo Turquoise by Holbein. And topping it off, we are going to use Iridescent Green Blue by Pebeo. And I didn't even get my hair dryer. I guess I need my hair dryer. Hmm, Alrighty then. So I'm going to be using the flower hair dryer for this one because this is a smaller canvas and I have better control um, when blowing out the paints with this. Uh, yeah, okay, so I'm going to put these back. I feel like I'm so confused and lost right now. <laughs> so much going on in my life right now. All right, now I am going to flood my canvas and I'll be right back. All right, the canvas has been flooded, the bubbles have been popped, and let's get started. So, oh, air bubble. All right, uh, composition-wise, we're going with the wispy. 
Um, so that is what my client um, would like. So let's go with, let's do a double wispy, I think. I, would, I didn't even really think about this. So I'm going to go like this and do a little mini and a little mini. So let's do that. Go like that. And we'll do a little mini this way and a little mini that way. That should be good. All right. Now we're doing the pearl blue. And then now with the 24 karat gold, don't forget, don't overdo it because it will take over the painting. And trust me when I tell you, you don't want that. So very little of the 24 karat gold. All right, Pearl Pink by Arteza. This is a pretty color. I'm loving these uh, new Arteza paints and they are just so beautiful. All right, Thalo Turquoise and Holbein. Holbein is also a very, very rich color. You want to be careful with that too. You don't want to overdo it because it is super, super rich Holbein paints. And topping it off, Blue Green Iridescent by Pebeo. All right. There are my colors. I'm going to pop the bubbles. Alrighty, let's get started. So I could start at either wispy. I'm going to, let's see, do I go this way? This way, straight up, then down, yeah. I'll blow into the negative space. All right, let's uh, let's see what happens. Wow. Okay. So I almost was like really stuck here in this spot after I had blown out this petal, but I ended up as I was going, Oh, look at those cells. Wow. That is pretty. So I've got the rose or the pink coming in here and there's some here. I hope it doesn't fall off too much. Let's see, I am going to fiddle a little bit with this spot right here um, because that's where my trouble spot was, but I'm very happy with this and I'm loving this gold border around and some nice pretty cells here. So I love it. Now let's fidget a little bit, not too much. I am going to blow a little bit here because the canvas is white right down here. So I'm going to blow that. 
just so that the paint falls down the side and matches with everything else. Now let's see what's going on right in here. That's better. There, just a super, super soft blow. You don't need to like really powerhouse it or just, you know, just super duper soft. Uh, I'm not liking this. Just looked a little odd, a little scraggly. All right, that is fixed. And I don't think I'm going to do anything else. Um, wait till you see this little cluster here. It is gorgeous. And that is it. I think I might just blow a little bit here, actually. There, I wanted to get some of that pinky coming out there. erase this little nub that's coming out there you go that's it all right i'm going to clean up my edges and i'll bring you guys in for a close-up be right back all right everybody so before i show you guys the close-up don't forget take your stick and you want to scrape those drips super duper important okay do it all the way around come back 10 minutes later do it again and then do it a third time and you should be good after that all right, look at this. I love it. It's so pretty. So let's start over here. And we've got the gold. There's going to be shimmer in this. So that is that cluster I was telling you about. I love it. Super pretty. And I love the hints of the pink in here. And let's see here. That's where I blew it out. Added a little more of the pink in there when I blew it out. And look at that cluster there. That's pretty. And then down here, there's another cluster. I love it. So that is what it looks like with the lights on. Let's put the flash on. All right, so the flash is on. And you can already see the overlay of beautiful shimmer in this piece. Of course, thanks to the 24 karat gold, but we also have the iridescent green blue in here that shimmers, as well as the pearl blue, which also shimmers. So. When this dries, it'll get a top coat of crystal resin. Look at that. Oh, and the pearl's also a shimmer as well. Super pretty. All right, let's turn the lights back on. So there you have it, everyone. I would love to know what you think about this piece in the comments below. Let me know what you think. And... Uh, don't forget, if you are interested in the Crystal Resin Kit, um, go on their website. I have provided the links in the description below. And that is it. Everything else you need to know is listed in the description below. Um, if you are new watching, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. And that is it for now. So until next time, guys, thank you again so much for watching. Have a good day. Have a good night. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.